hey everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here thank you so much for being here i'm so happy you're here don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave if you want to see more videos like this here on my channel and give it a thumbs up so i know you're enjoying these kinds of videos because these are my favorite videos to do or to watch and they're very entertaining so and most of the time i buy a bunch of stuff based off of what other people purchase so if you want to see more of those then subscribe and like i said like this video but if you're not new and you're already subscribed welcome back and thank you for being here too so for this video i decided that i'm going to be doing a haul on random stuff that i buy throughout the week because now keep in mind i don't do this all the time i don't think i just whenever i go to the store or whenever i get a chance to go to the store i love just grabbing a bunch of things that you know if i like it i'm gonna buy it and because you probably won't find it anywhere else anywhere recently i went to like marshall's home goods tj maxx you know the basics that everybody goes to and target some stuff from amazon and like just random places that I just find things and then I just pick them up and buy them. I am so nosy. I love to know what people purchase like on the regular basis or what they go to the store for. Like I'm always looking in people's carts like what are they buying? Or like where can I get that? Like I wanna know, you know, what people buy. So I'm not gonna go in any particular order. I'm just going to grab random stuff and show you what I bought. So the first thing in front of me is actually a mirror. So this is just a regular handheld, or not handheld, but you can put it on your desk or your vanity or something. And this was actually $9.99, so $10. And it's from the brand Silhouette. And I got this at Home Goods. And I've been wanting a close-up mirror because I gave mine to my sister, but I don't even think she uses it, so I should have snatched it back. But anyways, it comes very useful or like if I'm not wanting to do my makeup like in my room, I can like go to the restroom or go downstairs or something and just hold on to this mirror and I can just do my makeup with this basically anywhere that I take it to. But I thought this was really cute. They have a pink one, they have different colors, but I just decided to get the white because it matches my room the most. So this I purchased at Target and it was like seven or eight dollars and it's basically a weekly planner or day by day slash weekly planner. And it looks like this. So it looks like that, it's just kind of like to plan out the week and you have a little to-do list so you can write down any notes that you might have because if I write it down in my phone, I don't always go back to it or remember that I wrote it down there. So I figured having this like on my desk or on my dresser will be easier to stay organized and I can look at it every time I pass by and remember what I have to do. And it basically, and I thought it was really pretty. I love the gold. And like on the side, it has like that like, sh uh, I don't know what kind of color or pattern, but it's like a metallic color on the side. So I thought it was really pretty. So I picked that up from Target. I'm going in such a random order. I'm so sorry. I don't know, I'm just grabbing things. But at, where did I get these? These I got at Marshall's. I got two hats. I don't know why I already have a decent amount of hats. Like how many hats do you need? But I got two of them. Uh, one is a polo hat and the other one is just a random like I don't know what brand this is it's Mitchell and Ness so I don't know but I just liked it because it was very simple and it was black and it goes with anything and then I got a pink one because I love pink obviously these both are adjustable um, right here like it's like a magnet kind of clips honestly I use them more when I work out instead of going out in public but lately i've been loving wearing hats in public because one it's too hot here and second it's like you're kind of hiding from everybody so you know i don't have the tags on these anymore because i've been using them but i'm pretty sure this one was on clearance for like six dollars and then this one i think was also around the same price but i don't think it was on clearance Ooh. okay so next i bought a little candle it's so small like look how tiny so that is what this candle is it is from Wild Woods and it, no. So this is actually from DW Home. I know like a lot of people love their candles from TJ Maxx and stuff. And this is in the scent Pink Grapefruit. As if you can smell it through the camera, but it honestly smells very clean. I love these kind of wicks cause I feel like they last longer. It smells like trolleys, like the candy, if you know what that is, I'm sure you do. And this is a baby one. It's not like small, small, like the tiny ones, but it's a good size because I always switch my candles. So I'm never burning like just one usually. I like to switch them out. And I believe this one was $3.99, so $4. They last a long time. So yeah, I, I always seem to pick up a candle now because 
it's just so relaxing to have a candle. Like I literally have one from Bath and Body Works right now. Always gotta have the candle burning. So right after I left the candle aisle, I went to the picture frames. I found this really cool, really cool picture frame. And this one was $6.99. I know the photo is like way too small. I need to find a printer. I need to print out a bigger photo, but it's so cool. Like I just thought it was really like geometric looking. Since everything in my room is pretty much like boxy or square furniture or something, I figured to add some more shapes in my room. I've never seen anything like this. All right guys, so next, this is so funny. My sister ended up buying it the other day we went to the store and I really wanted my own because I didn't want to take hers. So I was like, hopefully I can find one. The last time I went like to purchase this, I was like, I hope I can find it again. So luckily I didn't find it, but somehow like right after I left that aisle that this was from, she found it. So anyways, it is a cat book sticker. This is like probably my favorite thing ever. My grandma has a cat and like, I never really liked cats, but because she got one, like I love that cat now. It's literally just a book of cat stickers. It's so cute. Honestly, I got this because I wanted to put them on my laptop. So I'm excited. This was $2.99. I didn't even know they had stickers at TJ Maxx. Honestly, I just overlooked them probably. All right, we're gonna switch it up again just because I bought most of my stuff from TJ Maxx and all of those stores. I actually ordered something from Amazon and I ended up getting some glow in the dark stars because my siblings have them um, in their rooms and I really wanted some because I haven't had these since I was small. So these are literally just glow in the dark stickers or you know, you put the little stuff, you know how it works. But um, yeah, so they're just basic glow in the dark stars, comes with a little moon. I got this on Amazon. I think they were, honestly, I don't know. I think it was like no more than $10. Maybe they were 14 or honestly, they could be way less. I don't even remember. Yeah, it comes with 200 stars and I'm gonna put these up on my wall. And I know a lot of people, if you don't know this, but you have to charge them with a bunch of light. So turn on your lights let them charge pretty much and then at night they will be really i'm so excited it's like little things like little things that just make your room cozy you know i've actually been painting a lot more and getting into art and like crafts and stuff mainly like art like drawing painting so anyways i bought a sketchbook from tj and tj max and this was i believe 6.99 so like seven dollars and it's pretty much just like a drawing notebook like it's empty just empty paper and I thought this was really cool because the way that it's like heavy duty so it won't like wrinkle or anything instead of just using like regular copy paper now I have a journal and because I went on a craze like especially during back to school when all the uh, school supplies came out I bought like so many markers and like colored pencils and I felt like a little kid again so I was just really happy to purchase this and now I can fill it up with my drawings Speaking of school supplies, when I went to Target a couple of trips back, I was looking for a dry erase board because I have been wanting to purchase one for my wall. I looked on Amazon and they were just kind of mm, not aesthetic. So I went to Target and I found some, but they were kind of, they were more than I, what I wanted to spend. But I found one um, at TJ Maxx and this was $7.99 looks like so i obviously got it because it's white the all white words are all right guys so i saved the best for last i got two plants i've been wanting plants in my room for the longest time i have little baby plants kind of like around my room but i wanted a little bit more of a bigger plant and these were bigger than the ones i have so anyways i got two of them these are from tj maxx i think this one was like four or six dollars this one was 13 but i i had to get it because of the aesthetic and i love plants that aren't like too green like these are kind of like that white kind of green you know so i got these and i thought they were going to be perfect in my room for my bookshelf and maybe on my um dresser like look how cool like look at this it is so cool i love the wood they have a blue one i ended up getting the pink one and then i got this little white one because white goes with everything and i have pretty much everything white in my room but yes i'm so happy that i got plants like i don't know it just I feel like I like being in nature outside, but now that I can bring it into my room somewhat, I'm happy about that. 
hopefully you're still here and watching and if you are comment down below i'm still here or something alrighty guys so for the last part of my haul i actually went to sephora and i purchased a couple things as if i need more makeup but you know how it is so i purchased the brand new Too faced foundation that just came out the born this way matte foundation and i thought this was a concealer at first it looks just like the concealer right but it's the foundation and it comes with a pump i already used it but um it does come with a pump and the claims say that it is oil free oil controlling waterproof and transfer resistant i actually have it on right now so we're gonna see if it last all day and if it does i will let you know and if you're curious i got the shade golden beige because i do have a little bit of a tan right now i also got another foundation just because i am a little bit darker so i wanted some more shades to use right now but in general i've been wanting this foundation for a while and it was on sale so i picked it up and i bought it it's the bite beauty change maker foundation uh, this one's in the color M55 and I wore it the other day and it's super lightweight, very natural looking. It's medium coverage, but to me, like it was so lightweight and it just evened out my skin tone so pretty. I love the way that it felt and it made my skin feel very hydrated and very just, very, it just made my skin feel fresh. And it's a clean brand, so it doesn't have anything that you probably don't want in your makeup. So I like the ingredients. I love that it's vegan. All right, the last two items that I got are from Kaja, Kaja Beauty, I think that's how you say it. And I've been wanting these forever and I finally bought them. This one's actually new. It's a new product that came out. It's a limited edition. It's Creamy Lip and Cheek Duo. And I got the color, I think the color, the whole thing is called Juicy Watermelon, but it comes with Pink Cloud and Vivid Papaya. So it looks like that. Honestly, the packaging is what got me and it's just quick, easy. So it just looks like this, if you can see that. It's like a little stack. So this is the color. So this is the color of one of them. And the second color. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's just so cute and tiny. I'm just excited. The next product is the Bounce Shimmer Eyeshadow Trio. I've been wanting these. I want all of them, guys. Like, I want all of them. If you own any of them, let me know. Tell me what you think. I've used it once. This is also another stack and this one is in the color Orange Blossom. I've used this one already. It also comes with this color. If you want a tutorial using these, me using these, let me know because I'm so down to do that. I'm so excited. And then this one also comes in there. It's easy, it's quick, it's so small, you can take it anywhere. You can probably even use it as highlighter. So. There's no limit. The limit does not exist. They're just so cute, you guys. Like, if you want a video, please, please let me know. <laughs> Yay! That's pretty much everything that I have for this haul. That was a lot, and I feel like I just went through it. But if you want to see more of these videos, like I said, like this video and let me know what your favorite thing is that I showed. And let me know if you've been shopping recently have you been shopping because i know a lot of people either want to go shopping or you don't want to go shopping especially because we have to wear masks and it's just a lot trust me i know but you know it's good to get out once in a while and at least stock up on something that you might need because i get a lot of essentials from the store like you know razors loofahs random stuff like that let me know what you guys have been doing and hopefully you guys are all doing well and that was everything for this haul thank you so much again for watching i hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to subscribe before you leave and give this video a thumbs up and leave your requests down below let me know what you want to see on my channel i love doing makeup videos and lifestyle videos but whatever you guys want to see let me know and don't forget to follow me on my instagram yeah that's pretty much it. I don't think I have anything else to say. So thank you guys again for watching and I will see you all in another video.